Hello, I'm Shauna Cardoza, a licensed pest professional with Corky's Pest Control. I'm talking to you today about a few mosquito preventative measures that you must take to successfully control mosquito populations on your property. The three main disease-carrying mosquito species we deal with in California are the Anopheles, the Aedes, and the Culex mosquitoes. They are responsible for transmitting diseases such as Zika, West Nile, heartworm, dengue, yellow fever, and malaria. Mosquitoes fly upwind at three to five miles an hour and are attracted to carbon dioxide. That's what we exhale. Mosquitoes tend to rest on the undersides of leaves and dense foliage. They will also rest underneath your eaves and the shadowy parts of your home. So first and foremost, you must cut back overgrown foliage to assist in ridding your yard of harborage areas. Secondly, you must remove standing pools of water to eliminate mosquito breeding sites. Some examples of these would be potted plant water basins, ponds, and bird baths. Dense foliage provides much needed shade and a hiding area where they can rest undisturbed. A pesticide treatment to the undersides of the leaves, as well as window casings, door frames, eaves, and structures foundation is an important part in controlling mosquito populations. It helps to control mosquitoes that are currently present and migrating mosquitoes. To keep mosquito populations under control, a regularly scheduled maintenance program must be implemented. Products break down over time, and mosquitoes will migrate onto your property from neighboring landscapes. So complete elimination is not possible. It's recommended to receive a treatment monthly during mosquito breeding season. Some additional actions you can take to assist in protecting yourself and your home are making sure your screens are in good condition and fit properly, wearing insect repellent like DEET while you're outdoors, and using citronella candles or torches while you are outside entertaining to help mask the carbon dioxide element. I hope I was able to answer most of your concerns today on mosquito control and preventative measures.